Hey, welcome back. Today I want to show you the sweep feature in Onshape. It's different from the loft feature because in loft you need to have two different sketches and you loft in between the sketches. So those profiles or those shapes that you're lofting between can be different. And that's the point of it. While a sweep, you're taking one sketch and you're sweeping along a path specifically. So for instance, I want to make a paperclip. I have one sketch where I have a paperclip shape. And in a different plane um, where I want my sketch to be swept through, I have a, another sketch of a shape and then I can sweep it. So sweep, this is the actual shape I want to sweep. So that's my circle here. And the path is going to be whatever path you want it to be. This just happens to be paperclip shaped, right? So just like with extrude, we have new, add, remove, intersect. And there you go, right? I swept a circular shape along a pathway and got a new part. Uh, this also works when you want to sweep, uh, when your uh, sweep path is not actually part of the uh, shape that you're extruding. So on here, I have a pipe elbow. The sketch that I am sweeping is just this part of the pipe. And to make the actual shape of the pipe, I've drawn a sketch for a sweep path. And then I swept along that path. So even though my uh, sweep path was not part of my sketch, wasn't touching anywhere, still works, uh, a normal extrude, you can do a sweep remove. So right now I have a sketch on top and a sweep path over here on the side, not even touching. Doesn't matter, but I can go to remove. I can choose that and make this my sweep path. And you'll see that I've removed along that angle. Now it might not look like that was a rectangle being swept along, but it is. Oh, well, that's it, really. Pretty simple. That's sweeping on shape. Good luck, have fun.